What's up, Vapors? It is Drop Dead Reviews, and I'm Dakota. Yeah, Chris. And we're starting a new juice review for you guys. Um, this is on the Raz Brizzle. Ha! I think. Is that yeah. Raz Brizzle? Yeah, the Raz Brizzle. Hey, what's up, Vapors? It is Dakota from Drop Dead Reviews with Chris. And we are reviewing the Raz Brizzle. By I think I think it's Elysian Labs. Yeah, Elysian Labs. Uh, three milligram nicotine strength and sixty mil bottle. The mix is seventy thirty blend. And we are also I'm rocking a hundred and ten watts on zero point thirteen ohm resistance. And these are alien staple staple fused aliens. And uh, he's running alien. Yeah, there's no way. At what wattage? I'm at 120 watts at 0.12 ohms. And we're going to drip this and we're going to give you all our honest review on it. Yep, it's First, we're going to do a smell test. This smells so refreshing. And I, I, get, I get the raspberry. Yeah, so raspberry is supposed to be like a, like a lemonade or a lemon. I kind of get a lemon. Yeah, the lemon's not very strong, but the, the raspberry, raspberry. The raspberry's definitely there. Drip some in there. Drip a little bit more in mine. I have it already dripped. Let's get a vape. Vapor production. As you can see, we're doing what a 7030 is supposed to do. Oh, yeah, here we go. It's actually a raspberry lime lemonade. So, <clears throat> uh, the lemonade's definitely there. Um, it's not overpowering, neither is the lime. Um, the raspberry is clearly the dominant flavor in this, at least for me and my experience of vaping this so far. I definitely get the raspberry right off real. You get the raspberry flavoring. And I get a subtle lime. Like when I'm inhaling and when I'm blowing out, I get the lemon. Very refreshing bait. Perfect for the summertime. Perfect for so Oh, yeah, definitely. I was thinking about that. Um, today is definitely a refreshing um, flavor. To me, this is definitely an all day bait. If I had the money, I'd go out and buy this right now myself. Um, but for me, yeah, raspberry straight on the inhale and the exhale. Um, I get a little bit of the lime on the when I inhale it and get the lemon as the undertone flavor there. The smell, I get, I, I give it a nine on the smell. Solid nine. Solid yeah. nine. Yeah, solid nine. Um, on the vape, for sweetness, on the sweetness scale, I give it a, I give it an eight. Yeah, I'd give it an eight. This is uh, pretty sweet. It's juice. pretty sweet, but it's not too, too overpowering. This is, you won't get, it won't get like overbearing for us. Oh, that's subjective. So. Yeah, and uh, I just want to speak about the reason why we, since we got two of us, you get two different opinions. Um, but I mean, ours is pretty similar, but at least you know that you get two different types of opinions when we do these reviews, guys. So, yeah. It's rocking. And we're going to be doing other reviews too. Like I said, uh, we got these, these are home science schools. We'll also leave these in the description so you can. Cups. Oh yeah, these are some great cools for a great price. Um, we just recently started um, buying our yeah. buy, buying cools and actually putting them in. First time I think uh, we actually went to our local bait shop and uh, the bait guy there said we did pretty good at putting them in. So yeah, this is our first time actually installing the cools, and we're also using the Fireboat Cotton in this. We will be doing a review on that as well. Oh yeah, that stuff is and, great. Yeah. Rip Trippers really knew what he was talking about when he said this stuff is good. But that's also off subjective. So compared to the cotton bacon, it's a lot better. More uh, absorbent. It's really absorbent. Like, <laughs> you could just drip all day in this. And on these cools, at least in my experience, I even if I over drip, I don't get any you spit back. That. None. The only thing I get is gurgle. That's it. Just but gurgle. after like at least a puff or two, it's gone. Yeah, we are, and I'm also, this is the Vupu Drag, I forgot to talk about my mod. This is the Vupu Drag, 
157 watt with the Genie chip. I just got this in. And of course, we are also rocking the drop dead RDA. And of course, we are doing that. And maybe in the future, we'll get I have some different money. RDAs, but right now, our pocketbook saying <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. And if you guys couldn't obviously tell, we got a new backdrop here. You can kind of see all the stuff we got there at the top. Plenty more juices to review. Some we have reviewed and some we haven't. Um, but yeah, we gave us our, we gave y'all our honest 100% uh, review of this juice. And will we cop out and buy? For me, 100% yes. It will be in my daily rotation. I, I'm the type of person I like having, you know, juices in my daily rotation. I don't know why, but it's just me. As a vapor, yeah, I would go cop out and buy. A solid, if I had to say, if I reviewed the whole juice entirely on a scale of 1 to 10, I would give it an 8.5. Yeah, I would definitely, um, next to Mr. Meringue, I'd say this is probably the be uh, next best flavor next to that. Um, Mr. Meringue, um, it's a pretty good flavor, actually, um, but this is like top notch. This is like the second best flavor I've actually ever tried. So. Yeah, we we actually just I actually just purchased that, just purchased that today, and I wanted we wanted to review it fast because you know it could have been all gone. <laughs> because I mean, it's that good. It is that good? Yeah, there are some different flavors as well, um, like straw rasm and all that. And as you can see, it's a clear juice, and we'll let you also know in further reviews if it was terrible on our cotton or not. Because, you know, sweet juices will gunk up your cools. Darker juices will gunk up your cools. You just got to you know when to change. Oh, juices. yeah, um, one more thing. Just on the, uh, the, the sweet shop, the green apple one, um, for at least for my cotton, it did gunk it up really bad. Um, that, that's not, I'm not going to take away points from it for that, but it did get really brown. It didn't take away from the flavor, but just letting you guys know, it did gunk them up quite a bit. Um, it didn't take very long, but... Yeah, we just installed this cotton today, so it's clean cotton. Clean cotton, yep. But that has been Drop Dead Reviews, you guys. Don't forget to smash that like button and also share it for others to see. And if you want to sponsor us, just hit us up in the emails. And we'll see you guys in the next review. Drop dead out.